did you know that not everything is as it seems? I know, shocker, right? So, do you have a desire to buy or sell real estate, but all the sources around you are telling you to wait until the market changes? Not sure who to believe or what to believe? Well, stay with me just for a minute so I can try to help you sort all of this out based upon my... Here's the deal. Home prices are not decreasing. They're just not inflated like they used to be. Buyers who needed a home earlier in the year were competing against all these other buyers and having to pay twenty, thirty thousand dollars $30,000 over, waive inspections, do an appraisal gap in order to beat out their competition. Well, Diana, what about all the price reductions I'm seeing, you might ask? Look, I love my fellow realtors. This is a tough job, no matter what people may think. Agents are competing for business and sellers still believe that they can get twenty to $30,000 over asking like their neighbors and their friends did just a few short months ago. So agents are still testing the market right now. It's hard to determine pricing right now without a lot of analysis of the market. So price reductions are happening in part because we're still setting home prices based on May and June's market instead of today. Price reductions do not mean that your home's value is decreasing like news sources want us to believe. It simply means that home prices are no longer overinflated as they were during the prime selling season. But also understand this, with the forgiveness of student loans, um, many buyers are or will become eligible again after October 31st. So I know, regardless of whether you're a fan of student loan forgiveness or not, the point is that it may actually end up helping the housing market, which by the way, is still the cornerstone of our economy. Here's my personal opinion about what's really going on. If we can manipulate consumer confidence and get people to think that they shouldn't buy or sell anything right now, we can manipulate the economy. There is a push to make more people renters. And the problem with renting is that you're paying somebody else's mortgage instead of your own. And you're not ever gonna own your own home. So owning your own home is still one of the most lucrative investments you can make. And let's talk about those interest rates. We've become accustomed to interest rates under 5%, but it wasn't that very long ago that 6% was the norm. And for uh, the generation of my parents, they will tell you it was more like 13, 14% interest rates. So even interest rates are normalizing. Now I'm not proposing that we should stay at higher interest rates. Obviously I'm not all about making higher payments on my mortgage rates. Um, but what I am saying is that the sky is not falling and the market is not crashing. We are just going back to a time where things are beginning to be a little more normal. And I don't profess to be a professional economist, although I do have a minor in political science. Um, but let me just break it down like this. I believe mortgage rates will continue to go up at least for the next year and a half or so. And who knows how long the rebound period will be. So unless you are putting your home buying or selling goals on hold for the next two to three years, the time to buy a home is now. Housing prices aren't getting any cheaper anytime soon, and I think most of your housing experts will agree with that. You will never buy a home cheaper in the future than you can buy it right now. So, if you want more information on housing trends, just subscribe to my market updates at www.onenationhomes.com 
or you can follow me here on YouTube, Instagram, TikTok, Facebook. Um, we would love to be your hometown go-to experts for listing pricing and marketing strategy. And our marketing strategy is this, just that. It's a strategy based on market data, based on buyer behavior, and tailored specifically for your home and your area. So we still have tons of buyers in our database. We work with buyers every day as well as sellers. We know exactly what they're looking for in a home and we can help you take the necessary steps to get the most amount of money out of your home in the least amount of time. So if you'd like to work together, just call 314-603-0487. This is Diana Allen, and I hope you all have a great day.